Hey entrepreneurs, today I wanna to challenge you to take this concept of the 10X strategy, which is the method by which you, th you think, okay, if we didn't just do this linear progression in our progress toward a goal, but we 10X our output or 10X the speed at which we achieve some amazing business outcome. By thinking 10X, sometimes it stretches your brain. It causes you to think way outside the box. And as a result, sometimes you see an opportunity that's real that you could actually implement. And maybe it's not 10X, maybe it's three and a half X or something. But the, the strategy is to get yourself to stop thinking what would just be a marginal improvement and instead say, well, if we had the 10X our, our output or our productivity or our speed to the goal, how would we do it? So I want to read this quote to you from a book called Work Less, Make More. This is by James Shramko and um, Kelly Exeter. So that he says, here's where I'm going to suggest something counterintuitive. I'm going to ask you to immediately reduce your work hours. Why? because it's very hard to find the energy and mental space you need to increase your revenue if you're working long hours day in and day out. So if you think about this, this is kind of like the reverse of 10X. Like if I said to you, I want you to take your 12 hour workday and comp compress it to six, what would happen? Your brain would start to get creative, right? You'd start to think, well, that's not possible at first. And then if I said, yeah, but you've got to, especially on a day when you're feeling overwhelmed already, if I said, you can't work long hours. In fact, you're gonna work less than you normally do. What are we gonna do? Your brain's gonna flip into a different mode. You're gonna to start to think of things, well, you know, I guess if I just had to do only this, we could get away with that and we could buy ourselves time to do this. I guess I could delegate this to this other person. I usually wouldn't. We could ask for some extra time to work on that project so we can finish this one. You would start to think outside the box, right? And that's part of how Parkinson's law works. You know, that concept that work expands to fill the time available for its completion. And so we want to use Parkinson's law against Parkinson's law. We want to use it in your favor. So instead of saying, you know, I have 12 hours to work and then you're going to fill that 12 hours and your brain's not going to work at the same level, the same capacity because of that. You want to give yourself smaller time chunks to work in because you're actually going to work faster if you know you're actually going to cut yourself off at the end of that. So this challenge for you this week is to ask yourself, where am I letting myself just kind of wander and meander through my work? If I was to shrink it down, if I did the half X instead of the 10 X, how could I get more done in less time, potentially reinvest that time in things outside of work, things that enrich your life in some way, or just get to where you're, you've built the mental habit for compressing how long things take and reach a higher level of energy, a higher level of output for yourself. So there you have it. That's your challenge for this week. I just want you to think of one thing, one area of your business. Maybe it's the time that you spend in meetings with your team. Maybe it's the time that you spend copywriting. Maybe it's the time that you spend going through financial reports. Find something and just say, all right, whatever this is, if it usually just has this sort of open-ended, I'm just gonna work on it till I'm done. Try time boxing, try to do reverse time boxing where you're taking all of these tasks, the recurring tasks or administrative things, and you're compressing them into a smaller amount of time. What's gonna happen is you're going to rise to the challenge, even if you, you go just a tiny bit over it, knowing you have that goal, turns it into a bit of a game. So by gamifying this, by going for a PR, which is another fun way to do this, a, pers a personal record, over the next couple of weeks, you can see if, let's say it takes you two hours to do like weekly admin tasks that are recurring tasks in your business. See if you could shrink that down to an hour and 10 minutes and then just one hour and just kind of, Keep going for that PR until you feel like, you know what, any any below that and I'm going to start cutting corners that are going to cost me instead of helping. That's your challenge this week. Go for it. I'll talk to you again soon.